What's up, great people? Johnny and Omega here. As always, if you handle the music, I'll handle the business. And today I want to talk about discouragement. So a lot of times, if we're not... Let's get the monitors in there. That's kind of a cool shot, right? A lot of times we think that if we're not super famous instantly, that, you know, we're failures at music and that we don't have a shot. And it's just not true. Some of the most talented people that have done music didn't make it right off. Actually, look at basketball. Let's take sports. Everyone loves a good sports analogy. Michael Jordan, he didn't make the team. If he would have quit because he didn't make the Aren't those birds amazing? They just kind of sound amazing. Squirrel. But Michael Jordan, he didn't make the team. Had he quit, we wouldn't have Jordan sneakers today. And that's what's important. Jordan sneakers. But, you know, if MJ would have quit, we wouldn't have one of the greatest basketball players there ever was. Don't be discouraged if you don't make it instantly. If it doesn't just happen instantaneously. Most things in life you have to work for, regardless what that thing is. You know, you have to fight for it. You have to push for it. You have to... Aim toward the mark of the high calling, as they say. Yeah. So don't get discouraged if your first single doesn't make you a million dollars and doesn't go quadruple, you know, triple platinum. It really wasn't designed to. You know, my bishop at the church that I go to, he talks about gatekeepers. And he says that there are gatekeepers at every level of success meant to keep that level pure and keep the people that aren't going to honor that level out meaning you wouldn't want everyone in the marine corps right or in the the military because if some people suck the country wouldn't be safe you only want the elite so boot camp weeds out those who wouldn't fit the job so the gatekeepers or the process weeds out those that just aren't going to work hard to maintain that level if everyone went platinum no one would respect platinum artists anymore if everyone could do what you do at your job or whatever you do, then why should someone respect the skills that you have? And with all of that said, just don't be discouraged. Be encouraged that every time you do music, every time you're contributing to your own success, contributing to your own forward movement, know that you're one step closer to making it big and to achieving your goal. Don't let discouragement be something you plan in your heart. There are many comedians that say they went on stage and a comedian at the time who was bigger than they were said they sucked. And then later when they blew past that comedian, that person said, you know, who knew? You know, Eddie Murphy has this story that Rodney Dangerfield said, hey, basically that act will never work. And after Eddie Murphy surpassed Rodney Dangerfield, he saw him again. Rodney Dangerfield told the man, "Who, who knew? You know, who knew that? This would work. Who knew that, you know, this would be a real thing. So don't get discouraged. Don't let other people discourage you. Don't let life or the process discourage you. Just do your thing and let it happen. All right. Peace.